tonight, the 5-1-1 one one first place Caledonia Corvairs attack the 0-9 Buffalo Regals. Now down the right wing wall, Lindbergh to the corner for Maksimovic. The shot, they score! Ryan Punkery, two, step, two and a half steps inside the line at the top of the blue line. And video production presentation of, here's the shot, quick shot by Bedenti, he scores. West found Bedenti on the forehand. Papano down the wing board, now Trublin an interception at the dot, moves around the defender. Trublin spinning, Kersitz around, shot, the rebound, they score! Ryan Punkery grabs his own rebound. Exactly on center was Gardner during the long shoot-in. He goes off on a change now. Play down the right wing, front of the net, shot by Hewlett, he scores! Austin Hewlett with 5.54 remaining in the period. Gardner loses possession, Moro to Corey, scores! Beautiful goal by Zach Kaur. Zach Kaur, the 6'2", 192-pound right defender. The, the Ticats down 29-9 after three quarters. Hewlett scoring quickly, the pass off out of the corner. I think Monachino is going to get the first assist. Maholland loses the draw to Caledonia. Trublin back to the right side. Off the draw, they score! Rising shot by Kaur. Played out the left side. Moro to the net. Maksimovic at the end line. Find some speed around the corner, they score! Quick shot. See if Ganyu or Maksimovic, who gets credit for the goal here. Benjamin Lindbergh lost possession. Shot empty net, they score! Fletcher upends his man after the goal. Maksimovic. The horn goes, the power play goal by Punkery at 741 of the first, the only goal the Corvairs would need on this night. Punkery, the game winning goal as teammates congratulate Stephen Harvey on the shutout. The Corvairs add eight more. Their best offensive output, five in the first, three in the second, and the Bailey Fletcher goal from Maksimovic with 12.46 remaining the only goal of the third period. The Caledonia Corvairs win in convincing fashion over the Buffalo Regals by a final score of nine to nothing.